It wasn't the victorious comeback he wanted, but Cebuano wingman Patrick Jan Kabahug certainly made his presence felt in his very first game for the Cebu City Sharks in the Maharlika Pilipinas Basketball League MPBL, Dadu Cup on Tuesday night. The Sharks suffered their second straight loss of this tournament, getting beaten by the Paranac Patriots, 73-81, in a crushing loss for a team backed by Casino Ethyl Alcohol that led by as much as 15, 32-17, in the first half. Cobdahug was on fire all game long as he kept the Sharks within striking distance with his patented perimeter mix. The former University of the Visayas and Adamson product finished with a game-high 29 points on 10 of 23 shooting. Afterwards, he narrated how he couldn't sleep the night before his first game in the MPBL. There are no words to describe the feeling of coming home to a packed stadium with people cheering your every move. I could hardly sleep the night before because I was overwhelmed by the buzz of excitement. I was just very happy to be home, said Kabahug, who had played nearly a decade in various leagues around the ASEAN region before coming home to play for his hometown Sharks. Kabahug also pointed to the need to develop better chemistry amongst teammates if they are to break this losing spell. It's very clear that our opponents had the upper hand because of their experience playing together as a complete team since earlier in the year. But I feel this gave us the chance to pinpoint what needs to be worked on, our chemistry as a team. Once we learn and put into play our strengths as a unit, I feel we can play calmer and more compassed games which would help us achieve our goals, added Kabahug. The Sharks, however, have yet to figure out who their head coach would be as sources have said the team has already relieved Gilbert Castillo of his post and is set to tap veteran mentor, Tiding Manalili, as the new head coach. Manalili, who functioned as head coach against the Patriots though, still has to clear things up with the University of San Jose Recoletos, the Sasafi school that he was slated to coach at but has apparently resigned from.